This is what the automatic voice activated switch looks like. It is used to turn on or off an appliance using a sound enabled control switch. It can also be used as a power saving device that switches appliances on only when it detects sounds due to human occupancy. After assembling this kit, you will learn about sound sensing, the working of a microphone, electromechanical relay, comparator and voltage regulator. This is the microphone. This is the relay. This is the sensitivity potentiometer VR1. This is the delay potentiometer VR2. This is the input supply. And this is the output supply for the voice controlled appliance. Adjust VR1 such that it is at maximum or clockwise position. Adjust VR2 to a position to suit your delay requirements. For demo purpose, we have kept VR2 at minimum position so the appliance takes the least amount of time to switch off. Insert the 12 volt DC power supply to the circuit through the power jack. As soon as the power supply is fed to the circuit, you will hear a sound and LED1 will blink once. LED2 will also light up which after a few seconds will turn off. LED1 indicates the presence of voice and LED2 indicates that the relay is working. Now keep rotating the potentiometer VR1 in the anti-clockwise direction and talk near the microphone until LED1 starts blinking. On, 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 on. LED1 will blink once but LED2 will keep glowing and the relay starts working. This function indicates that the circuit is accepting the voice signal and is working properly. Now connect the battery to the circuit and the appliance to the control board. We are connecting a normal fan in this case. Let us try the previous procedure with the appliance connected. You can also decrease and increase the working time of your voice controlled appliance by adjusting the potentiometer VR2 to anti-clockwise direction and clockwise direction respectively.